Hey everyone, this is Jeff Salzenstein, and I've got a question for you. What's it like to be a pro tennis player? That's actually the question that has been asked to me so many times over the years because I did play 11 years on the ATP Tour and had some very, very interesting, exciting, and sometimes not so glamorous experiences. And that's actually what I want to talk about today because tennis, pro tennis is not a glamorous job. You know, so many junior players want to be pro tennis players. They, they see the limelight, they see the US Open, they see Wimbledon, but what about these smaller events that you have to play at for many years, which I actually did being a journeyman pro. Well, in this particular story today, I wanna to talk about a time that I went to India. Now, fortunately, I didn't play any futures in India, didn't even play any challengers. I was playing an ATP event, so I actually stayed in a five-star hotel that week in Madras or Chennai, India. They have two names there. But what I remember is flying in at midnight into Chennai and my bags didn't come. The next night, I actually drove myself, well, with a cab. The cab took me out to the airport at midnight because all the flights come in at midnight. I went out the next day, that next evening, my bags didn't come. Went back to the hotel, still wearing the same stinky clothes from well, the last three days traveling, and I uh, went out the next night, no bags. For three days, I didn't get my bags in India. I'm trying to play a pro tournament. I'm practicing. I'm sweating. I borrowed some clothes from Jonathan Stark, who was a top number one doubles player in the world and a top singles player at one time, also another Stanford guy. But I also had to go to a market with millions of people swarming me. I went into this market and I bought Nike clothes because I was sponsored by Nike at the time. And I bought these generic knockoff Nike clothes. So I was literally wearing Indian Nike clothes as I was practicing and competing in Chennai, India for an ATP event. So tennis is not always glamorous. You've got to adapt. And that's my story from India. I hope, hopefully you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, we're going to give you some more tales in the future of what happened, life on tour, what it was like. But in the meantime, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I feel like I'm doing everything I can to help you improve your tennis with the lessons and the stories. And we'll go ahead and see you at the next video. Go ahead and subscribe and have a great day out there.